Hello! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to sell with Amazon FBA business. Selling with Amazon's fulfillment by Amazon, that's FBA program, can streamline your e-commerce business by allowing Amazon to handle storage, packing, and shipping of your products. Here's how to get started. The first thing you need to do is to create an Amazon seller account. How do you create one from the Amazon website? In your main Amazon website, hover over the account and list option and from the drop down menu, click on start a selling account and it's going to take you right into this window. In this window, you can create an Amazon seller account by hitting on the sign up button in here. Once you click on the sign up button, it's going to take you to a website or let's say a page where you'll be presented a form that you need to fill out. All you just need to do in the form is to enter your business details because you need to register your business as an Amazon seller. Now, once you've followed through with all of the prompts to create your seller account, I do not have the documents required, so I cannot create a seller account for now. But once you click on the sign up button, just follow through with the prompts, your self explanatory, just fill out necessary details they need to know about your business and you'll be good to go. Okay, so after setting your account, the next thing to do is to do a market research. Okay, so this is just like a, a pro tip for you. So research and identify profitable products to sell. That's the first thing. So use tools like Jungle Scout, Helium 10, or Keepa to analyze sales trends and competition. Then you also need to decide whether you will source products from wholesalers, manufacturers, or privately build your own products. Once you've decided that, then in the central, in the seller central website where you're in, or in your sales account, I'm sorry about that. It now sounds like a tongue twister. In your seller central account, you're going to find the inventory tab. Go to the inventory tab and select fulfillment by Amazon. Then follow the prompts to enroll in the FBA program. I'd like you to know a bit about labeling. Amazon requires each item to have a scannable barcode, which is the NFSKU. You can print labels yourself or choose Amazon to label your products for a fee. Then ensure your products are packaged according to Amazon's guidelines to prevent damage during shipping. Then, in the Manage Inventory section, select the product you want to ship to Amazon. Then, Click on Actions and choose Send slash Restock Inventory. I'll go over that again. In the Manage Inventory section, select the product you want to ship to Amazon. Click on Actions and choose Send slash Restock Inventory. Then follow the steps to create your shipment plan, including selecting the shipping method. Pack your product according to Amazon's requirements, ensuring they are secure and properly labeled. Print the shipping labels provided by Amazon and send your product to the designated fulfillment center. Of course, you need to optimize your listing. So write clear and compelling titles and descriptions that include relevant keywords to improve search visibility. And use professional images that showcase your products effectively. Include multiple angles and lifestyle images if possible. Research similar products to set competitive prices. Consider using tools to monitor pricing trends. Consider offering promotions, coupons, and discounts to attract buyers. Regularly monitor your inventory levels in your seller center to prevent stockout. And use Amazon still to analyze sales performance. Keep track of key performance indicators, KPIs, such as order defect rate, late shipping rate, and customer feedback to maintain a healthy seller account. Use Amazon's advertising options, such as sponsored products, to increase visibility and drive traffic to your listing. Promote your product through social media, email marketing, and collaborations with influencers to reach a wider audience. Now, regularly review sales data and customer feedback to identify areas for improvement. Be flexible and ready to adjust your product offerings, marketing strategies, and pricing based on market trends and consumer behavior. 
Now, enrolling in FBA automatically qualifies your product for Amazon Prime, increasing their appeal to customers. Although Amazon handles most customer service inquiries for FBA orders, go ahead and maintain good communication and respond promptly to any question or concerns. If you're selling books, consider using KDP, that's the Kindle Direct Publishing, in conjunction with FBA to maximize your reach. So by following the steps, you can successfully establish and grow your Amazon FBA business. Now go over the tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you'll be good to go. I hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search.